Hello everybody and welcome back to a new video here on Go With The Temper Gaming. Today we're going to be playing Answer Not. Now, the only thing I know about this game is that we play as a character named Zack and we just lost our wife, June. And we want to do everything we can to be able to keep listening to her voice messages, her voicemails. So, I hope you guys are excited. I hope you guys will enjoy this video. Please do leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel if you do end up enjoying this video. And let's just get into it. Hey Zach. Okay, I wasn't calling for anything in particular. I just wanted to talk to you. It's not that I'm bored or anything, not at all. Tuesdays are always a lot of fun. And Stacy got that right. Fucking Stacy. As if I didn't have enough work already. Anywho. Yeah, don't forget to book this year's destination, okay? Kitty cats. Since you're not over busy working from home. No, mister, you're not fooling me. I know you didn't forget about it. Yep, I saw the catalogs on the table, Zach. Learn to hide your evidence, sweetheart. <laughs> and I also know how much you love these messages, but come on. Sometimes it's just a dream of you answering the phone so I don't feel like a crazy person talking to herself all the time. Shit. Jeff's coming. Okay, talk to you later. Love you. Hi. Okay, let's see. What? What's that? They can't get my name right. Cake is a hey, lie. Sorry, I just finished. I get stuck again. Because of Stacy and her great habit of leaving work early. Yeah, as usual. You know, this time I had to proofread her whole paper before I went into print. Anyway, I'll be home in about an hour. Hey, could you please get the chicken out of the freezer for tonight? Thanks. See you in a bit. Do I have Love to go you. get the fucking chicken? I thought we... Is that the chicken? Yes. Okay. Zach, do you need anything from the drugstore? I just stopped to buy cigarettes and I'm looking at the beers right now. Oh, well, if you could answer the phone, it might make things easier for me. But yeah, just call me back quickly if you want some. No touching. I'm oh, finishing but tonight. Please do check if there are any left before you make me buy new ones, okay? Love you. Friends yeah. places for inspiration. So is that June? That's us? I wasn't really listening to what she was saying, so... I hope I didn't miss anything. Your PC broke again, right? You should ask your friend Kenny. He's like... Charlie, you totally fix it up in no time. I can call him for you if the phone really is a problem. Oh, I can just... Okay. To do today. Finish Vietnam report. Finish mood boards for DBS magazine project. Cook a real meal for real. 20 minutes guitar, clean desk, or not, or yes, cookies, electricity bill, change hard drive, water plants so they don't die, laundry, god damn it, okay, can't look at that, we can't look at this, bonjour les amis, les amis, my French was never that great, we made it to Paris, and here's and there's not a second we spent without thinking about you guys. We found this mar marvel as marvel as marvel as spa a few days ago that we've spent every afternoon in since. Aiden is so relaxed now, and he can't even feel his body anymore. That that winky face is suspicious. 
Have an awesome normal day back home. Jody and Aiden. Jody and Aiden Holmes. June and Zach Irvine. Okay. What's this? Everyday heroes. Photo contest. Heroism. Heroism and lifestyle. You're gonna be part of the jury. Zach Irvine. Okay. Can we... Can, thank you. I already forgot what I had to do. Well, this is a mess. What happened here? Can't look at that, okay. Travel notes. Note to self, buy new notebook. Nepal. Weirdest thing happened today. We tried to go and visit Shambhala without, with Zach, as Chloe recommended lately, but turns out half the, temple are, half the temples are gone. Blown up. According to the... What does that say? Some bizarre treasure hunter came over with his team and suddenly gunfire, rockets and helicopters even. And now we welcome... Now we welcome to visit ruins and ashes. This was not the kind of trip Zack and I were expecting, really. I can't help but ponder. What were they thinking? Oh, that was it. Okay. Oh, there's another note here. Mind control facility. It basically is. Coming soon. Okay. Treats? Stacy wrote this. Physiotherapy. How to treat back pains. Oh, I could really use a book like that. My back is not what it should be. Reminder. Please read these manuscripts to help you, sweetheart. The Morphing by Cassandra Troy, based on true events. You're gonna be the first one. Okay, well, if you want me to read it, then let me be able to read the whole thing. So is that June and us together? Oh, that was it. Okay. So, do I have to do what the list says that we have to do? Like, the chores and everything? Aldous Huxley, Brave New World. I told you. Okay. But, there's something in it. Okay, whatever. I feel like we should be able to see more with that, but... Okay, what was on here? Finish Vietnam report, finish mood board, cook a real meal, 20 minutes of guitar. Where's our guitar? What's over there? music sheets a safe okay is the laundry seriously blocking our way oh, okay I guess it is bang bang my baby shot me down First, second. Oh, there was a. There was one with third on it. Somewhere, right? I'm not crazy, right? No, here. We can't do anything with it. I 
After the worldwide famous Babyface, the visionary painter unveils his new work, Inheritance. The rest is blocked off. Okay, but... Does it have any meaning to it? Fish? A lamp? Like a baby cow or something? And some teeth? Well, those are weird photos, not gonna lie. Zach, do you need anything from the drugstore? I just stopped to buy cigarettes and I'm looking at the beers right now. Oh, do I need to check the beer? Uh, well, if you could answer the phone, it might make things easier for me. But yeah, just call me back quickly if you want some. Oh, but please do check if there are any left before you make me buy new ones, okay? No. Love you. See ya. Oh, I do. Are there beers? There are no beers. No bears. What's that? Admire someone else's beauty without questioning your own. That's that's a good thing to do, to listen to. That's that's a good quote. Caretaker of the year. Oh, that was that. Uh, I'm really not sure what I need to do because... Okay, what was the first thing on the list here? Finnish Vietnam report. Calamaro Gigante. Italia. Gorgeous village hanging on the rocks above the Mediterranean Sea. An old shell collector told me the name of the place meant giant squid. What a weird choice. Yeah. Absu Lagoon. Absolutely can't remember if that's June or me. The guide, maybe? <laughs> that's funny. Jin. It seems like it says Janina, but it's Geneva, right? Switzerland. Trip to visit June's little brother. The little brat is still doing wonderfully in the kern. She's so unbearably proud. Yeah, Geneva. Geneva's lake helps a lot relieving tensions and forgetting you're the dumb one. Bright side. Calvin came along. The meeting I'll cherish forever in my head and keep in this notebook. The day our brothers met. That's cute. Oh, here it is. Okay. Come on. You notice the key is missing, right? We're on a budget tune. Nice start. Really reminds me of something. Well, I used to be able to be able to read music sheets, but not anymore. Okay, finish Vietnam report, it says. Like, do I have to do the things that are on that list? Or do I just have to do what she tells me on the voice mails? Some more pictures. Okay. I don't know what that's supposed to tell me though. Oh, we have a motorcycle. Okay, out in nature. Oh, the kitty cats! Are those our kitty cats? Where are they? I want the kitty cats. What, what can I do with the stuff on the table? Have I even checked that properly?
that seems like it's something important. Oh, doggy. Okay. Dear Esther, thanks for the pictures. I... Are we gone? Well, she never or he never finished that postcard. He spilled his water. What? Even more pictures. How many pictures do you need in life? Okay, those are beautiful. But still. I honestly have no clue what the game wants me to do. Can you do these covers today, please? No, because I don't know how. My name is Zach, and I never use the phone. The introverts anonymous disapprove the shaming. Yeah, we do. Campo Santos Sports Center. Straighting age three. three. Adult group every Wednesday. Swimming with Ellie from The Last of Us. Ensure the safety of your family. Register now and we install your shelter tomorrow. Okay, well that's a bit extreme. No. What? What do I need to do? Like, if I play this again. Zach, do you need anything from yeah, the drugstore? Yeah, it's just the same thing. I just stopped to buy cigarettes and I'm looking at the beers right now. Oh, do I need uh, to go? Well, if you could answer the phone, it might make things beers. easier for me. But yeah, just call me back quickly if you want some. Oh, but please do check if there are any left before you make me buy new ones, okay? Love you. See ya. Can we go get some beers? No? Can the subtitles go away? Like, I know you love me. No, I guess not. Okay. Can I go out here? No? I mean, there are no beers in the fridge, so... What the hell? Oh. You haven't called me back. I assume you didn't want to Why beers. weren't the beers Actually, in the fridge? I'm, I'm stuck in traffic right now. Can you believe this? Uh, another shitty day, yeah. Traffic at almost 8 p.m. What the fuck, right? Yeah, what that the fuck? That definitely makes me want to be on a motorcycle right now. And yeah, I know. You're always right, I know. But you don't need to get out all the motorcycle ads before I arrive, you know? I'm not gonna buy one today. Okay, don't get too bored while waiting for your dear wife to crawl home. Love you. What? Can you, can you, can you stay open? No, okay. Apparently not. Why aren't the beers in the fridge though? Like you want your beers to be cold, right? Or am I dumb? I mean, I never drink beer, so. Hypnotism, the benefits, value, and dangers. Kelvin gave this for you yesterday as a warning. He's all into sleepwalking cures and a might blocking powers against evil forces now. His latest theory is that you'll end up a brainless puppet that follows everything I say if I keep taking you to if I keep talking to you in your sleep. Next time we visit, give your brother a hug and tell him you love him, will you? He's already going to dislike me. And please, 
Don't read this bullshit. Okay. You got it. You're a monster. Well, I would clean it up if I could, but I can't. Can I check any of the cabinets? Like, what do I do now? Can I clean up? No. What did she say in that last voice message? Like, waiting for her to come home? How? I mean, if I was waiting for somebody to come home, I would just... Chill. Why does that sound like the door opens, but it doesn't actually open? Can I? No, okay. Wait, what's up with this safe? Like, that has to be something, right? Like, what? Since you haven't called me back, I assume you didn't want beer. But actually, I'm calling because I'm stuck in traffic right now. Can you believe this? Uh, another shitty day, yeah. Traffic at almost 8 p.m. What the fuck, right? That definitely makes me want to be on a motorcycle right now. And yeah, I know. You're always right, I know. But you don't need to get out all the motorcycle ads before I arrive, you know? I'm not gonna buy one today. Okay, don't get too bored while waiting for your dear wife to crawl home. Love you. Okay, can't really do anything with those. I am so confused right now. Like... Those are cool pictures. done all that like finished mood board for dbs project took a real meal like all those things i'm just like well if the game wants me to do that then i don't know how The Holy Bible. Oh, I looked at those as well. I thought I missed those before. Why is... That's weird. That's... For a second I thought I could actually do something with that, but no. on the TV? Can I sit down and chill? Wait for my wife to get home? No. This time she didn't really leave like a clue. Shopping list. Computer tower. PlayStation 1 with an E. Guitar, three or four pairs of shoes, coats and coat hanger, backpack, desk furniture, scissors, tape, eraser, random books, first floor jacket. Do I? Like, what do I do with that? 
Like everything I see seems important, but then it also seems like I can't do anything. So that just gets me confused about what I have to do. Because in the last voicemail, it was obvious that I needed to check for beer, but I just messed up by thinking that they would have their beers in the fridge. I feel like I'm supposed to be able to... Like, why does it close automatically? Like, why do I feel like something is messing up here? Like, do I need to be able to grab a beer to, like, relax for her and wait for her to get home or something? Okay, wait, what, what is she, she was talking about motorcycles, right? Is there anything in here about motorcycles? Not right here, right? Nothing, right? Oh, what's that? Can I look at that? Travel dream. Oh, that's what she said that she found. The Adventures of Paul Prospero. When the police won't help you and the priest won't believe you, call Paul Prospero. Okay, but I'm looking for something with motorcycles. Because that's the last thing she talked about, right? That's not it. I know I saw something somewhere, right? Or... Or not. Oh no, I saw... Pictures of a motorcycle. That's what I saw. I haven't seen... Well, that was the pictures that we looked at before. Okay. That's that one book. There's some more pictures. Fashion. Physiotherapy. Am I an idiot? Like, there has to be something on motorcycles here somewhere, right? Is it like right here? No. Am I blind again? Anything? That's the postcard that we saw earlier. Oh, right here. Okay. This one. The Ducati Thousand. Jam, but I don't know, something's weird. The cars are barely moving one inch an hour. And first I thought it was an accident, but it looks like cops are inspecting the cars as if they were looking for something. I wonder what's going on. Have you heard anything about a terrorist attack? Like on the radio or the paper? 
I really hope not. Call me back as soon as you can, okay? Please. So I have oh momentum. Oh. Okay, so now I can listen Breaking to the radio. News. If you're planning on going in and out of the city of roses, you'll have to be patient. Unexpected traffic jams have paralyzed the city of Portland. Many people are still trying to get home as we speak. The cause is still unknown, but Helen, I'm sure, is just another poor dog locked in a car. More on that later, but now, here's some jazz. Okay. So they don't really give any information. What about the newspaper? Coding may destroy the world now. We like monochrome pictures. I can't read that, so... What is that sound? Hello? What? Like... I want to. Thank you. Hey, it's odd. I'm, I'm, I'm still stuck in the same traffic jam, but I don't know. Something's weird. The cars are barely moving one inch an hour. At first, I thought it was an accident, but it looks like cops are inspecting the cars as if they were looking for something. I wonder what's going on. Have, have you heard anything about a terrorist attack? Like on the radio or at the paper? I really hope not. Call me back as soon as you can, okay? Please. Okay. So she does say radio and paper. Oh. Is that a new paper? Newspaper. Pick it up. Come on. You got you got this. Wyoming on fire. Disruptive fire against ground in Wyoming. New archaeological archeolo discovery in Kenya. The archaeological team led by Professor Jean Raymond in Kenya discovered this week a new specimen of dinosaur presumed to be dated from the Paleolithic age. The bones and structure of the specimen are in great shape, almost intact, declared Dr. Ra Professor Raymond. It's really difficult to date the, this discovery since it's a whole new species we discovered here. Scandal in scientific community. Slowly they morph. Could it be possible that an alien life finally encountered Earth? That is the subject of liquid light. Dangerous psychiatric patient escaped and scares drivers on Route 26. That's it. Around 3 p.m. on Sunday, drivers on their way to, Port to Portland through Route 26 got a big scare. Indeed, a man described as extremely tall and barely clothed started walking on a busy driveway as the car drove by him. Witnesses say that he stood in the middle of the road and then tried to follow the cars. When we passed him by, he stared at us with a strange look on his face. Others reported the men tried to jump on their car and attack them. Most simply observed, observed the man they described as disoriented, standing on the side of the road. Authorities didn't take long to take the deranged man into care and remove him from the area. The police li liaison, David du Dupine? Revealed the man was a patient of the New Newmark Psychiatric Psych My brain can process this for some reason. Word that escaped earlier that day. Authorities have authority have yet have not yet revealed the identity of said patient, but claimed the situation was under control and that the man was not a danger to population anymore. Newmark Hospital failed to provide any new information or comment on the case 
and is remaining silent. It was all more, all more fair than harm in the end. Okay, so we took those two. Hey Zach, it's me again. You won't believe it. A cop made us all get out of our cars and, and now, now we're all waiting for a bus? No explanation? I, I don't know what the fuck's going on. I, I had to leave all my work in the car. Like, how am I gonna get it back? <sighs> Something's really out of order tonight. Yeah. Not to mention, you're not answering the frigging phone and it's really frustrating. What are you even doing? Did you get all the messages? If you're falling asleep, I will find out, you know. You always make such a mess on the couch and you never clean up and I... Oh. Wait. A bus has arrived. Wait. Uh, okay. I I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get it on the bus. Okay, I'll, I'll call you back. No way in hell that I would get on a random bus without them telling me why. So do I need to clean this? But I can't move that. What are those sounds that I've been hearing? Okay. What's the that was easy enough. Having a phone if you don't answer it. I know, I know. I'm sorry. Sleep at night, Mister. Anyhow, I'm in the bus. It's supposed to take us out of the city. I, I don't know exactly where they'll drop us, but I'll manage to find a way home. I think they got this under control. Whatever this is. The strangest thing is that no one even knows what's going on. Someone said he heard that strange things happen all over town. Did you hear anything back home? Is everything like normal? I mean, I wouldn't say normal, but... I don't want to sound alarming, but... You still have the gun somewhere, right? We have a gun. It's still loaded, isn't it? I have absolutely no idea what it could be, but I've seen strange people standing on the side of the road like they popped out of nowhere and... So it wasn't just oh, one man. Yeah. Please call me if you hear or see anything, or even just to let me know you're not dead, please. So we have to get a gun. Oh, is that when we get to use the safe? I mean... Oh, how would I know that? No. Can I... Go back? Hello? Game? So how am I supposed to figure out what the... No. What the code is. Oh! First. Five. Second. Three. And then fourth is two. So five, three. Five, three. One, two. Right? Five, three, one, two. Five, three, one, two. Yes. Take. Zach, now pick have the, up gun. the phone for God's sake. What are you doing? Do you even hear it ring? No, I don't. Fucking crazy night. Zach, if you hear me, the boss dropped us somewhere near Pinwheel Street and. They told me a shuttle to Campo Santo would come any minutes. I'm almost there, okay? Uh, an old guy said that aliens have come. That's what we're facing. That aliens. they're everywhere and... Oh, God, I read an that article make about sense, that. Right? Aliens? Come on. He said crazy things and he had like a panic attack and some, some cops had to calm him down and... Well, listen. According to a security guard, the shuttle will drop me in our street at 10 sharp. Please make sure you're here at 10 o'clock, Zach, okay? Please, keep an eye on the clock and don't let me down. What, what aliens even look like? That's, that's 
Which time is it? Just call me back, please. Where do we have a clock? Oh, here. Turn. Zach, wake up, please. Answer the phone. It's already past 10 o'clock. Okay, I finally got on the shuttle. I, I don't know why it arrived so late. Yeah. That alien story spread, and now everyone's convinced we're like invaded down here. I'm keeping my voice down because everyone's so tense. Understandably. Oh, I can't wait for this night to end. Please, Zach. Wake up and call me back, please. I really need to hear your voice right now. I don't know what led to this strange creature's bullshit, but please lock everything up, okay? And stay okay. inside. Lock up the windows, too. You stay inside until I come back, okay? Don't let anything come in. Be safe. Well, that one's... Lock up, yeah. Lock up. Okay. Were those all open before? Did I just not notice? Oh, we have more windows here. Let's do those first. Are these closed? This is all just closed. Okay, now the front door. What is that sound? Walk up. Okay. Have I missed something? Some reason that worked. The whole troop, they, they, they attacked this big. We had an accident and. Oh my god. They, they jumped on the shuttle and. Come, come and get me, please. They're, they're here. It, it, it's real. It's real. They're. They want sex. Please come and get me because I'm really scared and I'm afraid. Oh no. Do we have a power switch somewhere? What's this? Oh. What the hell? What? That was not a man's hand. Were we an alien? Just listening to her or did we already die? Holy shit. That was so... Such an easy game to, to play, to get through. But the story is so... What? So... Did we both die? During that night? Like, what is the story here? I'm I'm gonna look it up for you guys so I can actually let you guys know. Okay, so there are two options for this story. Um, the literal approach would be that the aliens actually invaded Earth, and that an alien killed Zack, took over, and we're just roaming around in the house as an alien, which would explain why we weren't able to answer the phone. And it would make sense why we wouldn't answer the phone if we were Zack because it was made clear that Zack has extreme anxiety and doesn't like phone calls. So we wouldn't give it a second thought. There was another theory by somebody called Venkman on Steam and they seemed to think that Zack was just completely losing it and killed his wife. But I don't know how much logic is in that theory because when you are playing it doesn't really seem like you are playing as somebody who is losing his mind you know i think the game makers 
actually just wanted to tell a story about an alien invasion and having the plot twist at the end be that you were the alien all along. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. What approach would you guys like more? The literal ending with us being an alien or Zack losing his mind? Let me know down in the comments. Either way, I really enjoyed this game and I hope you guys did too. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please do leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel if you did enjoy the video and if you want to see more of my content. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!